I heard it's gonna be really scary. I've never been to one of these abandoned houses. I think it's over here. I know I hear some talking, maybe music. Yeah, I think it's here. Where is everyone? I just want to hear music. <laughs> What would George Romero do? Ah! <sighs> oh, thank God, Mother, you're so safe. Wait, where's Nola? Nolan, Nolan, where are you? Got back here. I think there's a murder on the loose. Oh no, I can't believe what said. I've never seen one of those before. We should split up and find some help. Okay. Okay, bye. So it's you who's been killing everyone. Here's justice for my friend.
We're leaving. What? You're old enough now to stay home alone, so we're gonna go on a romantic getaway. But if you're gone, you'll get me! He? There is no he. How many times do we have to go over this? There's nothing there. And if you're that scared, then find something on YouTube to help. Look, we've booked tickets, and there's nothing you can do. So, my parents are going on a romantic getaway. I wonder what George Romero would do. Matthew, come and say goodbye to us. Coming. Mom and Dad told me to look up how to stop night terror, so that's what I'll do. What is up, guys? Welcome to the new video. In this video, we're going to be talking about, uh, talking about night terrors. And, if you're watching this, then you've had night terrors like me before. And I'm here to tell you that they're all fake and not real. And, in this video, I'm going to be showing you a couple simple steps to completely remove night terrors from your dreams. Like this. Step- Wait, what? Time to go to bed.
for this party. She always says the best parties. I can't wait. It, there's always a fun surprise when we go there. Can you believe I have to be back at 10? Oh, jeez. My mom's so Hi. Hey guys, thanks. 
Thanks for coming. Thanks Hi, for inviting everyone. us. This looks amazing. Come over here, guys. And try to be completely still. Okay, so I can't wait for the surprise I planned for you, um, you guys because um, I prepared a seance. What's a seance? A seance is when you summon the dead. That sounds fun. How do we do that? Well, we can just like hold hands and like try to like um, close our eyes and um, try to like say words that creep everyone out. Eva, can you turn off the lights? Sure. Spirits, ghosts, zombies, vampires. I summon the powers of Halloween. Spirits, show yourself. <gasps> My name is Mary. I used to live here. And 60 years ago, I had a Halloween party just like this. And things didn't go so well. I have to warn you, for everything you do, don't go in the basement. Oh my gosh. We gotta go to the basement. Yeah, let's go. No, wait. This is a creepy basement. I can't believe I've never been down here before. I don't know what the witch was talking about. This is not that creepy at all. Well, let's explore and find out. We heard a scream. Is everything okay? Yes. Ah! Casey! Hang on a second. Where's the witch? I warned you. What was that? I think it was a ghost. Where did it come from? Eva, 
Papa, no! All your friends are dead. What are you gonna do about it? What would George Romero do? <laughs> My work here is done. Time to rid the neighborhood of the, the rest of the horrible children. Spirits, I summon you. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad that worked. Listen, we have a problem. It's a little hard to say, really. Nothing felt off at first. It was all just normal. It was subtle for a long time. Sometimes I'd get a paper cut and not know where it came from, but that's normal, right? It kind of crept up on me. first time I started to notice something was a couple days ago when I tried to make myself a sandwich. Honestly, I had no idea what to do about it. I thought my mind was playing tricks on me, and if I tried to show someone, they wouldn't see what I saw. I didn't want them to think I was crazy. They probably think that anyway after what happened to Sophie. We were watching a movie together, Halloween 4 or 5 I think, when she said we should watch The Crazies next. She said her mom loves George Romero movies and always thinks, what would George Romero do when she has any sort of problem? I thought we had a copy upstairs, so I got up to go look. I still haven't found her. I would have waited a couple days before calling the cops, but I didn't want her mom asking questions I couldn't answer when she didn't come home. It didn't take long for them to give up and start looking somewhere else. I ended up taking matters into my own hands. I didn't find much, but enough that I think it's some kind of demon. It seems to be concentrated in one of the rooms. There's a lot of paranormal energy in there. Can you tell us what room that is? Yeah, it's in the unfinished part of the basement. Do you want to see it?
This is so much fun. Yeah, but I wish Karen was here. Where is she? She's never late. Karen! Karen! You're finally here! Took you long enough. Karen, come here and dance with us. I gotta go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Tommy's dead. Somebody killed him. I'll go get help. There's gotta be a photo on here somewhere. Someone saw my friend. Hello? Why isn't it working? No, Karen! Hang on, if Karen is dead, then who's the clown? So why do we have to find Clara again? If there's a murder in the building, she could be in danger. We could be in danger. The murderer is with us. What? We know Clara couldn't have done it because she doesn't believe in violence. We know I couldn't have done it because I was in the washroom. So that leaves two people, Dominic and Karen. I'm just going to ask, if you did it, we won't be mad. Just be honest. Dominic, did you kill Tommy? No way. Tommy was my friend. I would never hurt him. Okay, Karen, did you kill Tommy? Well, that was easy. The murder is obviously... Dominic! Get him! Oops. <laughs> the next group of friends, my next victims. I don't know why I kill her, why I love it so much, but one thing is certain, I will never stop!
are you? I'm here at outside. You're not coming? Come on. You're my cameraman. What do you mean it's fake? It's Halloween. This is the perfect... Fine, coward. Okay, hey everyone, and happy Halloween. Uh, here, and then you're watching Phantom Chaser. I'm at the creepy abandoned warehouse where it is rumored that the Phantom haunts these halls. I'll send my update when I find something. Hello? Go stop the lost boy, are you there? I'm not scared. What you the weird stuff keeps happening. I'm sure that the ghost of the lost boy is in fact very real. Boy. You know who I am? I'm Phantom Chaser. You can't hide from me. Show yourself. <laughs> Go! Sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. I trapped it here last Halloween. I haven't seen so since. You will be my friend and stay here forever. You can even share my candy. Oh my god! Oh shit, I came up too strong again. Sam, where are you? Boo!
sure. Great, see you then. Okay, bye. Dang it. Here, do you girls want some popcorn? I oh, yeah. One. Yeah, sure. Thanks. Thanks. Mm. <laughs> what is this button do? I don't know. Should we try it? I don't know. What would George Romero do? Uh, he would probably try it. Okay, together. Okay, three, three two, two, one. What's going on? I think we're in the video game, and since the Halloween video game, it's gonna be really scary. How do we get out of here? I know how to get in there. Who are you? I'm the guy. I can help you get out of here. Can? Well, how do we get out of here? That's easy. All you have to do is follow the map. That's it? Wow, that's easy. There's one catch, though. There will be challenges along the way that you have to do, or you'll not be able to continue, and you'll be stuck here forever. <laughs> Let's just start. Yeah. It looks like the first thing you have to do is go through this haunted house. Oh no, you know I get spooked easily. Yeah, let's just get it over with. Yeah. Oh, this isn't so bad. Yeah. Ah! Mia, what's that? Oh no. What is it? It's a giant hot dog! <gasps> Boo. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. 
Josh, where are you? I don't know. I can see a light coming from the bottom of the door, and I can hear him on the other side of it. Who? There, there, there's a window here. I think I'm in the house on Highland Lane. The one through the cornfields. Come now, but no cops. Yeah, I'm on my way. Thank you. 